Is Saban is Saban leaving? You guys got any insight? Sorry, what? What? Excuse me? What? Where? I don't know. I was reading on the internet. Saban, there was there was a very, very Whoa. deep Alabama insider. Who, I was just reading the internet. Dumb. I know, this I don't believe Tommy everything Turin. I hear. That's why I'm asking. Where's he going? Is it Paul Assassin? I don't know. I was asking you guys. You guys are Nettie. best friends. Paul Assassin. They've been trying to spin that ever since he came on the show. Yeah, our show has certainly heightened the chatter about like you think old Saban would be doing a show every single week like McAfee show. Well, he has been doing a radio show pretty much yep. every week for like the last 10 years. So, yep. yeah, I think you, you see him smiling and laughing on that show, though. He's not as intense as he once was. He's definitely mm-hmm. and of course he's near. the. I mean, he's on a back nine for yeah. sure. Yeah. yeah, we all understand that with his entire career. What did you read, though? Legit, this is brand new news to me. I did not. I, read don't, it. I don't know. I was just, it was just on Twitter. It said uh, it was like, I mean. Yeah, X, whatever. Uh, it was on like the deep message boards, and they were like, this guy's been right about a bunch of stuff in the past, which I'm assuming means like private jet tracking. Um, and Ooh. so it said like Saban's on his way out for like a $30 million ESPN contract. So I figured who better to ask than the people on ESPN with $30 million contracts of their own that also happen to talk to Saban every week. So well, I'm doing the people's work on X. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. I, I appreciate good journalism. You know, sure. and uh, trying to guess a deal's worth, you know. Absolutely. And that whole thing, like, you, welcome to the club. There's been a lot of people doing that, speaking matter of fact, as opposed to asking questions. <laughs> That's real, though? Yeah. I don't know. That's a real thing. I have no idea. I mean, I also saw him. He had a triple styrofoam cup in his Ferrari. So, yeah. I don't know. It was pretty badass. And, and, in, the, and in the and in the yeah. side pocket. Yeah. In the, so, yeah. yeah, about 15 bags of red man. Yeah. Whoa. Excuse yeah. me, America's best. Thank you. Yeah. Jesus. That's not that's what, that's not what that's it's called. That's not what it's called. Team yeah. to boot. That's not that what was what called. it was named. That's not what it's called. If you're a Chaw guy, you'll never say America's best. It's red man, period. Sorry. You know, it just is what it is. That's, that's twice today. Yes. No, it that's is. twice that's today. Twice the talk. Yeah, yeah, you with the F bombs all over ESPN. Breaking news, highly respected sources have confirmed to MPG message board geniuses. Okay, sweet. <laughs> that Nick Saban will announce his retirement. That's my source, guys. MBG, <laughs> message board geniuses. Hey, congrats legit. to MBG. This is UGA Sports. It's a Georgia website. Don't too. get into the plane tracking <laughs> business. Look what, what we, happened to John Morose. Did dude. you see Georgia fans are trying to cancel all flights from Georgia to Nebraska, though? So Because of uh, Ray Oli? Really, yeah. That was hilarious. Hey, that was a good question for Bay Q. It's mm-hmm. Matt Rule. Yeah. Hey, did you listen to that yesterday at all, JJ? Did you get to see any of it? Matt Rule was legit on our show. He was good. I thought he was really good yesterday. Really good. He was really good. He is good. He seems to be good. I mean, I, I didn't I didn't get to see all of that, but I have seen his pregame speeches. They are phenomenal. Those were asked about, and he said those are those aren't prepared. Those aren't it's like in the moment how you feel. Which is nuts because some of them really like obviously that one that got popped up was three minutes. Every single one of them gets you jacked up. That guy loves coaching ball, dude. Fucking loves not him. not thought about beforehand at all. No, I think he said it's not like scripted. Like basically, he was has to think of concepts for sure. Mm-hmm. Like throughout yeah. the day, right, yeah, yeah. I'd assume you would have to think of concepts. You come across something, you see it, you're like, "That's good little angle. That's good angle right yeah. there. I could potentially use." Yeah, it. like the one we showed was for the breast cancer awareness. Yeah, oh, um, that one. Game. Yeah, I mean, awesome. And if ta- you if yeah. you don't go out there and play play your ass off after that, you you suck. He said that that was to honor you know his mom, I think his wife's mom, and everybody else. Like he uh, really from the heart there. I think he's building something special out there in Nebraska. He sold my ass yesterday. Yeah, yeah. scary. I'd I- like to man Nebraska. When Nebraska's good, it's cool. Like it's it, you know you kind of want those those programs that to be great. It's I mean, obviously, they're in the Big Ten, so I don't want them to be that good. I mean, I think we beat them every single time so far. But oh, why I do you want and Ty? Nebraska. Amen, brother. That's how you and that's how Ty was operating yesterday, too. <laughs> I was like, Ty, I think Nebraska, that was a cool thing. Ty goes, cool, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I used to love, I mean, I, I watched their tunnel walks from back in the day. Like, uh, like the, Nebraska is a cool program, man. It is just a cool old school program. I just don't, I don't know in today's day and age without, obviously, Paying just uh, an exorbitant amount of money. I don't know how you get kids to Nebraska when their options are, you know, some of these other. That's just that's just right. an honest fact. You, America, you yeah, don't can, know about Nebraska. Well, how come Wisconsin keeps bringing in transfer quarterbacks? It stinks. Oh, jeez. Oh, 
I mean, we got two great lakes. Uh, we have a beautiful, <laughs> we have a beautiful terrace with delicious beer. We have a phenomenal campus. And fickle. We have a, Figure it out, fickle. Fickle's yeah, a dog. We have a bunch of great stuff. Just give it some time. I mean, I'm, I, I've said it, I've said it already before. I'm not overly excited to be playing the Heisman Trophy winner in the bowl, the number thirteen team in the country on January first. Looking forward to the opportunity. Hoping we really rise to the occasion and step up to it. Hell but. Yeah. Uh, Certainly, certainly a tall task there. I uh, don't know how we got matched up with number 13. I will say that. We are not ranked. We don't have a ranking, and we got number 13. That was one of the most Wisconsin-sounding things I've heard. Looking forward to the opportunity. Yeah, yeah. That was like uh, <laughs> it was the so classic Midwestern, like, yeah. everything's good. Yeah. Woo, I mean, everything's guy's positive. got about 65 <laughs> touchdowns on the year, and... Uh, so it's a Big Ten sc- uh, show. A lot of Big oh, yeah. Ten on this particular mm-hmm. program. Hell yeah, brother! Lot, the juice. A lot of Big Ten. It looks very different. I, I have a question. Uh, yep. I know the rule. Maybe we've talked about it before. I know that the stipulation with the contract before the season. Don't believe it was met. What are they doing at offensive coordinator now? Yeah, oh, yeah. That shit canned him weeks ago. He's done at the end of the season. Listen to this, Jay. For sure, that's over. Yeah, yeah. the yep. AD made the decision. Listen to this, though. After it came out, the AD came out right. Yeah, interim AD. I think she is the AD now. She came out and said that he will no longer be with the Iowa Hawkeyes after this season. Brian Ferentz, the offense coordinator, who led the worst offense in football back-to-back-to-back years Mm -hmm. in college football, he protested the decision, wouldn't wear any Iowa Hawkeye logos on his stuff on the sideline, just all black shirts. He would He's... I'm getting fucked. This guy yep. led the worst. Merchant, I, I guarantee that he just plummeted merchandise sales. People said, if he's oh, not yeah. wearing it, I'm not wearing it. Yeah, definitely. Take Trust a stand. Good job. Take a stand. Good job. Really, I mean, way to step up to the man, you know. Uh- 